Canadians could finally be making the switch to electric cars. High gas prices and concern for the environment are fueling the market for zero emission vehicles. And a company in the Oceanside area is cashing in. A Canadian Electric Vehicles of Arrington sells electric conversion kits and utility vehicles all over the world, and they've noticed a spike in their Canadian sales. Our Jonathan Bartlett has the story. He joins us now in our 9 one newsroom. Jonathan. As in whether it's high gas prices, the BP oil spill in the Gulf, or concerns about the tar sands, Canadians could be finally coming around to embracing the electric car. So this is one of our most um, popular kits. An electric conversion kit like this will set you back about $12,000, but Randy Holmquist says it's well worth the cost. They run forever, especially these new AC motors. There's nothing to wear out. Canadian Electric Vehicles has been operating out of a small workshop in Arrington for 20 years. They sell electrical utility trucks called Mighty Truck, mostly to municipalities around North America. Uh, the Mighty Truck will pack about a 1,500-pound payload, so it's a great little municipal truck. Their electric conversion kits have been selling worldwide, but lately to more Canadians, who Holmquist says are finally getting it. This year we've actually seen, over the last three years, we've started to see more and more um, sales into Canada. The electric conversion kits sold to those who want to convert their gas guzzlers to clean zero emission electric vehicles are priced between four and fifteen thousand dollars. Three years ago, eighty percent of his sales of conversion kits were to the U.S. and abroad. Now, Holmquist says seventy percent of his sales are to Canadians. I think, uh, well, one has been the price of gas. Certainly, things like the BP oil spill. Um, there's been a lot of uh, stuff in the media recently about the, how dirty the tar sands are. Anything like that uh, makes people start to think about alternatives. Recent improvements of battery and drive system technology means converted cars can now get over 150 kilometers with one charge, well over the daily commute needs of most Canadians. With lead-acid batteries and DC drive systems, it was a fairly, um, usually a slow, fairly slow, you know, heavy vehicle. And now that we have lithium batteries and AC drive, uh, we're much more efficient and ranges are, are really increasing. Holmquist recommends that customers are mechanically inclined before they take on the project of converting their cars to zero emission. But he says more and more Canadians are choosing this method as an affordable alternative to gas or even hybrid vehicles. Hybrids are still running on gas. You know, unless you can plug it into the wall, it's still a gas-powered car. Randy Holmquist says he'd love to convince someone locally about the benefits of going electric despite selling conversion kits to customers as far away as India, Russia and Australia. He's yet to make a sale in his own backyard of Oceanside. Hudson? All right. Jonathan Bartlett, thank you. You're welcome.